This is like the thing that you see that's like, oh, the Badlands, it's got these cool things. Oh, look at this hill. Oh, oh very fun. What's up, ladies? We're back in the Badlands. I have a question for you guys. Whenever you like wash your helmet out and stuff, how do you get it to stop stinking? Or do you just have to buy a new one? Because, good lord, man, like, uh, <laughs> I washed this one out real nice, tried to like wipe everything out, but the straps have padding on them. And the straps, I'm pretty sure, are the part that still stinks. And I just can't get it to stop stinking. Oh, I have missed the Durs. I'm excited because, as you can see, nobody is here at all. The place is a ghost town, which is both exciting and scary because there's nobody out here to save you, but it's exciting because I don't have to worry about all the idiots in the way everywhere. <laughs> I did not know where that was going to go. I wish you guys could tell how steep this is. I love it in here. This is cool. I feel like that's all I say at this place. Oh, I love it in here. Oh, this, this is pretty neat. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. I love this. Oh, that was sick. Going up concrete like that, why does it scare me so much? If I wipe out on it, it's gonna be hard. You know? And it's bumpier. Hey, where's that intense uh, hill climb? Oh, the one up right there. Let's just try this one first. I guess it's just hill climb day today, boys. Oh, that was sick. Okay, we're gonna try the intense looking one. Wow. That was like a nice little brain teaser for me. That one felt scary. This hill looks sweet. Oh my God. <laughs> I did not expect it to dip so aggressively at the end. Come on, man. Oh, these are the parts that I've always wanted to go to. I finally found it. Oh my God. This is like the thing that you see that's like, oh, the Badlands, it's got these cool things. And I've literally never seen them till today. I don't even know what to do with myself. I'm so excited. Well, that is loud. Do I think I can go through this one? Yep. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's sick! <laughs> At least I knew where I was going this time. Woo. mud hole. Tell me if you guys feel this way as well. Whenever you're out here riding, like the first half hour to 45 minutes is a dream. Because you have all the energy in the world and you can conquer anything. And then after your first good wipeout or just after a certain amount of time 
of being on the bike, start making mistakes, and then you're just kind of delaying the inevitable of like, I am not doing well, I need to get out of here. This is the way I'm gonna be riding in uh, 50 years. Just be like, oh, look at this hill. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, there's some mud here, guys. Oh. I'm gonna get stuck being an idiot. Wee. Wee. Okay, we're gonna stand back up. We've had enough of a rest. Stand up with your shoulders back and take on the world. I'm Jordan Peterson. Jumping into a stream. Oh, that is a lot of agua. Do we have a little pathway around it for dirt bikes? <laughs> if I had a lighter bike through this stuff, how would it go through mud? Would it do that, what it just did? Well, I touched the brake. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so slippery, so slippery. I, I can't wait to try this stuff out, like slick snot mud on another bike. Cause look at that, like I almost brought the whole, the bike almost came around on me. Cause this is so slick. Glad I got these tires. Whew. I'm gonna take this yellow trail. Oh, very fun. Oh, I love this stuff. Just floating, you know, no big deal. Oh, kicking my ass, literally. Woo, woo. Look at those roots. Out into the quarry. Dude, that was so sick! Oh my gosh! Man, that was so fun! Okay guys, that is it for today. Thanks for joining me on the good old Durs. And we'll see you all later. Bye!